Hello everyone, in this video I'll tell you a very strong build to combine Necromancer summonings and spells. You'll have a ton of damage and CC if you wish to play any activity in the game. It's of course a free to play build, meaning that you don't need to spend any euro if you want to play this build. I'll start this build with the skills and you need to either play Bone Spear if you don't have the Trinity buff to play the Soul Fire. Then Dark Curse in order to debuff and deal some damage to the enemies. Bone Wall which will be combined to an item, I'll tell you after the one but it will help you to get some CC. Common Skeletons in order to have our minions and we'll use also the explosion from the item. Corpse Lens or Corpse Explosion, it will depend if you have some buff on your items for this spell or if you have the one from the Corpse Explosion. So about the stuff, we'll play the kill command and it will make your skeletons explode for ton of damage. Wall of Skeletons, this is what I mentioned when Bone Wall is converted to a Wall of Skeletons, granting a lot of CC. The increased duration for the curse, the damage for Corpse Lens in order to have more DPS, the damage from a common skeleton which is increased. For the chills, this power will redirect 10% on your common skeleton, so it will be a great boost of tankiness. For the gems, everlasting torment which is perfect for the critical strike. Carsen invigoration in order to have the boost of attack speed on your primary attack. If you are lucky, you have the blood socket jet, but otherwise you can use the Celed which give you increased damage after defining an elite pack. Berserker Eyes, you'll take more damage but do also a lot of damage. Chain Death because you'll often hit at multiple targets. Followers Burden to have the damage for each minion that you control. For the set, the best one is of course the Shepherd's Calls to Wolf in order to have more damage on our common skeletons which will stack with the explosion. Otherwise, you can get the PvP one or the Isatar set if you want to be very fast. I've listed everything on the website if you wish to find this particular set. I'll end up this video with the gameplay starting with the push of a greater rift. And it's quite cool to play because you just need to explode the monsters using your skeletons and then use the bone wall in order to have some CC and the dark curse to have the debuff and the damage over the time. It's also very strong in PvP, just change the Corp Explosion by the spell which can save your life plenty of times and after that you can just quickly kill your enemies. Thanks for watching this video. If you have, of course, any questions, feel free to post them on the YouTube channel directly.